Let this video be the one telling you what mistakes to avoid when creating Instagram Reels. These mistakes are preventing you from getting views, engagement, and maybe going viral. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am Rini Ismail. I'm a video producer at PitchPix.com. I am passionate about helping small business owners create better video content using minimal approach and gear. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and tap on the notification bell so you won't miss any of my future videos. I see many business owners creating this real mistake over and over again. In this video, you get to discover why your reels are not doing as well as they could. I'll be sharing with you three major mistakes you might be doing and let's fix that today. Mistake number one, not remaking your viral or semi-viral reels. I made this mistake when I first started Instagram reels. I was just doing a lot of reels but I was not focusing on a reel that actually really get a lot of attraction in terms of saves, in terms of shares and in terms of comments. For example, my reels, a lot of my audience actually love my tutorial reels. So I was not remaking them, I was creating a lot more other type of reels. So for yourself, you need to understand what kind of reels your audience are liking you doing. So you need to understand your insights, you need to understand your views, you need to understand your engagement. When that reel actually went semi-viral or even viral, recreate that and continue doing it. Another example, her name is Yasmin. She's one of my followers on Instagram. She did a lot of fantastic reels and a lot of her point of view and guidance on how to become a better business owner actually hit a lot of engagements in terms of her reels. So she knows what kind of reels her audience are always interacting with her. She has always been remaking this point of view or even um, tips on how to become a good business owner. Mistake number two is filming directly on Reels app. Okay, I may be joking. I'm not joking on this mistake. I actually experienced it myself. I've been always been creating on Reels app directly until one fine day, all my Reels draft vanish. Because Instagram Reels in Singapore is uh, fairly new, so they are bound to have a lot of glitches here and there sometimes the duration is not fitting sometimes the texts are all over the place even though in your draft it may be perfectly fine for you but once you upload it the texts are just all over the place and sometimes the draft will just disappear so for me i naturally will advise my clients or even my participants to create reels outside reels app but if you do create reels in the reels app itself make sure to download it as a backup and save it in your camera roll mistake number three text on screen so for text on screen imagine this is your instagram reel you are actually creating reel be sure to not have your text over the blue lines, whether it's below, on the sides, or even at the top, or even at the sides here on the heart shape, the speech bubble, and the share button. If you were to actually do that, then your audience will not be able to understand what you have written, they are not able to read what you have written, and that will actually affect the views, affect the engagement, and essentially it will not go viral. But if you are actually creating your real outside Reels app, make sure to also have that guideline and not go beyond the guideline. So you can actually do um, download a canvas on Canva, um, the 1080 pixel, yeah, the 1080 by 1350. Yes. The 1080 by 1350, have that on your editing app, just have the guidelines on it and put in the text within that box. So there you have it, three major mistakes you should avoid when creating your next reel. One more tips on how to make full use of the collab feature on Instagram Reel. Click on the video that is on your screen right now. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel for brand new videos every Wednesday. And leave a comment below which mistake you want to get rid of for your next reel.